<laughs> Jens, I'm sure your legs are going to thank you, but what was going through your mind knowing that this was the last time on the Champs-Élysées in your final tour? I'm pretty happy about it. Um, it was uh, another time a thrilling, hard finish. It was dangerous. Um, we had to make sure we don't lose time. Uh, that time of Sibelia keeps us eighth place overall. I had the chance and the order also to go out there, show my face one more time. You know, just the old story, me against the peloton. Um, happy the way it's finished. But yeah, I'm also really, really sad. The 17 years of my life, um, 340 stages today. Uh, I have done in the Tour de France. Um, it was a big chapter of my life and it's, it's finished now. So look for the challenges coming ahead. But yeah, this chapter is definitely finished. You've made a ton of fans when you were racing. So what, what will be next? Well, a big break. First of all, I'm going to refuse to touch my bike at least until Christmas time. <laughs> at least. <laughs> um, but um, yeah, I live in Germany. I pay my taxes there. I have six kids to feed, so I probably need a job that more or less soon starts coming in. Um, I think it's going to be a combination of, of different jobs, working with Trek, the company, working with the team, working with Trek Travel, um, finishing writing my book, um, just started a little business, you know, selling my own shirts with Shut Up Legs. So different of little things running parallel to each other, and then I take a year time to find out what actually, what do I like to do for the next 10 years and what I don't like. So I'm going to do a couple of different jobs, hopefully some commentating, stay involved with you guys maybe, <laughs> writing another column. So a couple of little jobs all together. So with 17 tours, any advice to give it to another rider that might want to achieve that kind of record? Just don't get intimidated by the challenge. Just don't give up. Every year you're going to hit the wall at least one time and go, I can't go. I, I can't reach Paris. I can't go on a bike tomorrow. But yes, you can. Yes, you can. Even though you're at Brecky and lifting up that spoon with muesli to your mouth is a big effort and you're too tired to eat. Never give up. That is the only thing that helps you. Congratulations. Thank you. Yes, uh, Boys, uh,